Hi, I'm here today to talk about our six ounce popcorn machine and give you some instructions on its use. When you rent the machine, you're gonna get this popcorn scooper, which you're gonna use later to pick your popcorn up and put it in the bags. Um, and you'll also get a 50 servings of popcorn bags and your popcorn and butter and salt and everything is included in there. So we're gonna start by you know, opening this up, which comes with every rental and uh, Inside there, as I, as I said, is a one ounce popcorn bag. I'm going to sit that to the side for now. Um, and then you're going to get what we call is a popcorn Nax pack. Um, what this includes is all of your popcorn, your butter, and then your salt. So everything's pre-measured in here. You don't need to worry about filling scoopers or measuring anything. Everything's kind of all done for you. So we're going to go ahead and use a scissor and open up the top of this. So once you have your popcorn uh, max pack open, what you're going to do is you're gonna raise up the lid to the kettle and you're gonna pour the entire contents of this bag into the machine. You wanna be sure to get all the butter out of that, all the, you know, the corn out of it and all the salt out of it so that basically you're left with an empty bag. Once you have that, you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna close the lid on the machine. Then you can go ahead and close all of the doors. The first button we're gonna talk about is the power button. The power button is something that when you turn it on, there's a light internal to the machine which can stay on all day. And in addition to that, it also has a warmer on the bottom of the machine that'll keep the popcorn hot. The next button is the important button, that's your kettle. Once you turn that on, the motor inside the machine is going to spin around to stir the popcorn and the kettle's gonna get warm popping your popcorn. Once the popcorn has uh, stopped popping, what you're going to do, you know, as it slows down, very similar to how you do it in the microwave, um, what you're going to do is you're going to take this little handle here and you're going to go ahead and turn that handle and just shake that kettle out. Make sure there's no popcorn left in there. You're going to turn your kettle switch off and enjoy your popcorn.